Aquarius. What do we got? This is for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This is for singles. Single and ready to mingle. Single, single, single and ready to mingle, mingle, mingle. Aquarius. What do we got for Aquarius? For the month of May, who's coming towards you? Ace of Pentacles, golden opportunity. It's a big one, too. This is a big, huge opportunity coming towards you. Could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I don't know, but this is a big opportunity. Something has been hidden. There's been something going on behind the scenes. You may... Oh, let me just keep going. Somebody may have been emotionally withdrawn and now they see the light. Maybe they've been hiding their true feelings. Now they see the light. Now things are being revealed to them that this could lead to victory and success. They're recognizing or they are being recognized or something like that. This is being recognized. Something is being recognized that this is a big, huge opportunity. Intuition is talking. Somebody's intuition has talking to the, been talk, is talking to them and they haven't been listening to their intuition. But this could lead to happiness, whatever it is. Oh my God. God. So there's been some family issues. There's, there could have been a family crisis or there could have been some kind of feuding going on that has made somebody recognize that, that there is a... Let me just get the rest of these cards. There is an opportunity for happiness. Somebody has been... It's almost like they've been hiding themselves. Somebody has been in hiding maybe maybe fearful of getting in a relationship maybe resisting change somebody has been resisting change they've been delaying their own happiness because they couldn't master their emotions we definitely have somebody here that has not been mastering their emotions and it's been hindering their wish fulfillment there could be some arrogance here Somebody's been going back and forth. They've been really on this emotional roller coaster per se over, you know, getting in a new relationship or clinging to the past, holding on to the past, letting the memories hold them back or getting in a new relationship, whatever the case is. Anyway, I feel like we have a, this is, this is a, this is something that has been manifested. Somebody has manifested a big, huge opportunity for happiness but I, I can see that somebody is, it's almost like they're blocking it or they have been blocking it because of memories, something like that. But this is a soulmate connection. So there's an opportunity to come together with somebody that you have probably known, maybe in your past or you've known this person before that could make you really happy. But you're going to have to um, face your fears. Fears have been in the way. I feel as though this could really lead to victory and success if somebody can really master their emotions and, you know, step out of their fear and realize that this is a big, huge opportunity. We do have a big, huge opportunity here. Somebody's been stuck. Somebody has been stuck in their own mental prison, you know, mentally trapped. Um, there's been a, and they've been reevaluating. I think that we have somebody here that has been reevaluating, you know, what to do next. I think things have been getting um, hotter and hotter and hotter for this person. It's like this person has been sweating. They've been sweating. It hasn't been easy. Um, They've been carrying a heavy, heavy load and, and trying not to fall down. This is eventually, this person is eventually going to come to the point where they are going to have to um, drop, drop it. They're just going to have to drop this, this past or they're going to have to drop the, the, the load that they have been carrying. Somebody has been overwhelmed with memories, I believe, and it has hindered their ability to get into a happy relationship. i got to be honest with you. Somebody um, has been letting their own mental conflict burden them to the point where they just, it's like they're at the point of collapse, you know?
there's a lot of tension here. There is a lot of tension. It's like there's a lot of players. There's a lot of people with their fingers in the pie, with their opinions. And, you know, there's a lot of players here that are affecting this person's happiness. So I really feel as though this coming up, there is going to be an opportunity to have a solid new beginning that could lead to happiness if somebody can master their emotions and this is my, both both of these somebody needs to find the ability to you know find that strength and that willpower to drop what doesn't serve them so that they can be happy there's an opportunity for happiness here and it may be something that you are really struggling with somebody is really struggling with mastering their emotions again seriously somebody's not, is, is really letting their thoughts hinder their happiness there's lack of confidence there's lack of uh courage here Somebody hasn't been handling a situation tactfully. And there's, it, there's, there's, it, it's like somebody's going to get hurt or somebody has gotten hurt. Somebody's going to get hurt by the games that are being played here. So we have somebody here that has probably withdrawn, you know, gone cold and withdrawn because... It seems like this is a game. Somebody sees this as a game. It's it's not really a game. It's it's, it's there's something going on. There's some there's more to meet than this than meets there's more to this than meets the eye with that moon card. Okay? There is. I feel like we have somebody here that is dealing with some family drama. They're dealing with some family conflict. They're trying to, you know, take care of everybody and everything. But there is a big, huge opportunity being presented to them. And for some reason, they can't find their ability to go after their wish fulfillment. It's like they see it as wish fulfillment, but they can't take it because they got too much going on here. There's too much going on. There's too many people involved. And it feels like so somebody is losing out in the love arena because of everybody else. But this is an exciting opportunity that really shouldn't be missed because whoever this person is, they're very well suited for you. So Aquarius, I think that you will probably be extending an, an invitation or you will be receiving an invitation or some good news from somebody that, you know, invites you to take a new adventure. This is a very exciting opportunity that could lead you down a new path. You have an opportunity right now to broaden your horizons and drop something so that and be happy. Okay, you do. You you you've been letting your somebody's been letting themselves be distracted by everything but what they truly wish for. Try to stay focused, really try to stay focused because I feel like we have a new suitor or we have somebody that is coming in that is very, very, very well suited for you. This person is probably younger than you and they can help you. They can help you. And I see that there's probably going to be an attraction to this person. This person is going to recognize your, your worth. This person recognizes your valor. This person is going to recognize your strength. You know, so I feel like we have an offer coming in, Aquarius, that this offer may have been rejected in the past because of some overwhelming circumstances, but, or it may have been delayed because of some overwhelming circumstances, but it feels like <laughs> I 
with some assertiveness, you could probably flip it around. We have a very stubborn individual here. Very stubborn, jealous individual who may have been unrealistic. She, have, she may have made a decision to just put an end. Okay, it looks like a decision has been made. I'm not going to communicate. It's like the sort of communication is put is down. Somebody has made, and this is a bull, and this is a bull. So we, we, I don't know if you're dealing with a Taurus or who you're dealing with, but we have a very stubborn individual who has decided to cut communication because of rejection. There's rejection here. So I feel like there's an opportunity to start over. There is an opportunity to start over. Wait, but this is faith. You need to have faith. You need to listen to your intuition. Listen to you. Somebody's dealing with a Taurus. We have all the signs here. It doesn't really matter. But this is an opportunity to be getting a commitment. I think this is, you got an exciting offer coming in that could lead to commitment if you could have faith and you could believe and you could trust. Somebody's been overwhelmed with responsibilities and they've put, it's almost like they've put a relationship on the back burner. But this is such a big, huge opportunity that, you know, it's just time to be happy. So I feel like we, Aquarius, that you may be realizing that it's time to be happy. It's time to follow your inner guide. It's time to bring balance and harmony back to your life and let go of something that doesn't serve you so that you can just be happy. This is I just want to be happy. Anyway, you guys are going to receive something. Okay, this is a gift. This is a true gift right here. You're going to be receiving some sort of gift. It is. It's a gift from above. Take it. It's exciting. It's an opportunity. I mean, you can really grow with this. It could lead to victory and success. It could lead to a marriage. It could lead to long-term commitment. It's a soulmate. It is. So, I, I mean, I think it is. I think it is. It may not be, but I think it is. I think that there's an exciting opportunity. You're going to receive some good news or you're going to deliver some good news. This is a very exciting time because this offer is so abundant. It's big. You have a big, huge opp opportunity here for success. I think you have manifested something and you are receiving something. And it could make you really, really happy. You have to decide, though. You have to decide, do you want it? And you have to stick to it. This is an opportunity to truly let go of the past and move forward. So this week, or whenever it happens in May, you're going to receive a, a, a golden opportunity in which I think that you should take. Don't shut yourself down emotionally because of somebody from the past. Drop those burdens Drop them. Whoever this is, they are going to recognize who you are, for who you are, okay? Anyway, that's what I got, Aquarius. I've went too long.